Hello, my friends. How is everybody doing today? I hope you were having a good old time. So, we are going to, uh, what are we going to do? We are going to take a look today at the game Toy Tactics. Uh, let me, let me get the audio going. One sec. There we go. Can we hear stuff? Oh gosh, it is so bright. One sec, let me. Uh, turn that down. I need to get Twitch up. All right. Everything should be working, I think. Maybe. I'm not entirely sure. How's everybody doing today? I hope you're having a good one. Uh, we're, yeah, we're going to take a look at Toy Tactics. They actually sent me an email and offered me a code and stuff for this game, but I don't like doing that because I feel like I want to give my actual... It's cheap. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Uh, I want to be able to give my actual impressions on a game, and I don't think that you can truly do that if you are being given it for free, if that makes sense. So, are we playing on PC or mobile client today? Um, I don't want to play on my phone. I got a phone case, though. It's got MimiQ on it. Uh, but, yeah. We're, we're going to play on a PC because... Why would I play on mobile what if I could play on PC? The art style looks cool, the gameplay mechanics look interesting, and I'm just genuinely curious to see what they have. This game is an early access. It has a free demo, and then the paid version is $19.99, plus shipping and handling. Okay, let's, uh... New game. Let's see what's going on here. Yeah, this is uh, for any developer. I'll apparently pay you $19.99 if you send me a nice email and offer me free stuff. <laughs> I might be an idiot. Erebus, a land beyond time and space, where fallen warriors from many realms and eras can rise to fight once more and become legends. Among them were the fearless legions of Imperium. These fighters conquered many regions and defeated countless enemies, proving to be exemplary so- Ahem! That's better. As I said, this mighty empire marched over the known world bringing order, aqueducts, grapes, and wild toga parties. Led by the charismatic Imperator and an iron-willed Centuriata, they were unmatched in battle. Until the Draugr arrived. A mighty horde of undead warriors, led by wicked sorcerers with intentions as awful as their smell. They stormed the legions by surprise, forcing them to retreat to their homeland, Orcus. All seemed dark for the Imperium. But then, a mysterious stranger, bearing gifts of ancient wisdom, appeared to share his teachings in the art of war. I, I didn't expect it to be Rome versus <laughs> Skyrim. <laughs> but okay. <laughs> That's what we got going on. It's kind of shaped like a golf course. Greetings. I am he who is called Sun Tzu. General, philosopher, and master strategist. All right. In this journey through the art of war, I will be your teacher and advisor. Shall we begin? First, behold, the brush of high command. A very valuable and ancient tool that, well, it has been stolen. First lesson, the art of war is always based on deception. I will say, this game is very charming currently. <laughs> I don't know how good the gameplay is, but everything so far has been quite charming. Now go after them. Move your group. Alright, so press and hold over the new formation and drag to the marked area. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay, I don't want to go that far though. I just want to go the marked area. Very easy to control. Yes, sir. I don't know why he doesn't have uh, voice acting anymore. He ran out. All right. Give Hunt to the Bush Thief. Destroy any opposing... Oh. Oh, that's cool. 
You can click and drag and they'll start moving even then. Oh, we can drive by. <laughs> Get him. All right, move forward, reach the burglar before he asks for reinforcements. Burglar is known for asking. So, I guess this is just the unit count here. It's like maybe unit type, unit count, just melee guys, six of them. Uh, am I getting... Okay, I'm supposed to lose. <laughs> we'll need heavy weaponry to open the way to the brush. The Imperator will lead the way through the end. Oh, he is a Chungus. All right, command him wisely. Go that way. Um. Wait, forward. <laughs> there we go, buddy. <laughs> oh, text block is covered a little bit. Yeah, let me, uh. Let me just... Da, 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 da. I teleported. Bet you didn't know I had that skill. The Imperator will lead the way through the enemy. Command him wisely. Man, he is a bonker. Look at him. Much better. Hurry up. Do not let him reach the fortified outpost or will require additional help. All right. How did I do that? Is a blink... Oh, no! We were too chungus! Ah. Oh. Well, that thief has taken refuge in the lockout, uh, lookout post. We'll have to raid it to get the brush back. Alrighty. Yes, sir. <laughs> Damn Draugr. They have no idea about architecture. Make your way to the camp to retrieve reinforcements. Oh my gosh, goats! Hello, sir. How are you doing on this blessed day? Would you like to be my friend, or are we going to stab you? No! Why have we done this? This is wrong. Uh, yeah, Alright, just move that guy right over here. Go bop him. Alright, let's go to the camp. Oh, skip and jump. This is a very interesting way to uh, reduce your animation budget. The game, it looks solid. I mean, it doesn't look like incredible, but it also doesn't look bad. But when you anything that looks stylized looks better. That's just how it goes. Age of Empires 5 looking nice, absolutely. Alright, so we hold both these to drag and move a king together with the infantry. Yeah, so they stay in formation effectively, right? Uh, I know a lot of this game is about formations and like easy formation creation and movement, and that's something that I I was really interested in. That's really the thing that uh made me want to see this. Okay. Z and C to rotate while drag... Oh. Okay, so we grab the formation and then we can put them in front and him in back. Which honestly seems like the wrong call. This guy is a destroyer of worlds. We should put him in the front. Right, let's go get this box. I hope it doesn't have uh, gotcha game mechanics. Watch out. It's a trap. Pause time with space to evaluate. Eh. Rear good oh, okay. They want us to reorganize our units. So we hit this. I don't know. We'll do that. Go get them. Well, I got an achievement. Achievement unlocked. Retrieve the brush. I don't I don't know about that, Steam. <laughs> I don't think that's what we did right now. <laughs> okay, we have to slay the enemy infantry, destroy the enemy target. Hey, these guys. Hey, these guys. Got him. Uh, how do we ro rotate the camera? There we go. Zoom that out a little bit. Uh, this box has to be a box, right? There's yeah, what'd we get? A fiery Pugio. What'd we do with that? I don't... <laughs> I have not been instructed on how to use items. <laughs> oh well. All right, we're going to move them all together in one giant blob because then it makes it easier to melee. I don't really like that it took my camera right there. I understand that this game is partially for mobile, so it kind of makes sense that uh, it has something like that. But for PC, I don't think that it's necessary, right? All right, get into the... <laughs> this guy is amazing. I am... 
Except I am a big fan of the fact that he sends people halfway across the continent. <laughs> Here they go. Okay, can we just like send him up here? You jump? No, he just he just smash. Oh, he can jump. Is it getting jenga All right, you guys hit the tower too. So I guess it's interesting that it rotated the camera to show the destruction effects instead of just having the destruction effects here as much. But I guess they want to show their flag too. did it oh my gosh our time was zero zero oh no it's actually gonna count <laughs> i thought we were the speed run world record holders all right tutorial was easy uh bu -bu -bu -bu. we got the box we got that let's continue are we the baddies no we're just roaming around these have been your first steps to learn the art of war. Now go forth. Erebus awaits. All right, here's my little pointy stick. Oh, this panel shows your obtained blessings. Your units can equip one blessing at a time. Choose wisely. Small chance to put an enemy on fire. Higher chance of deflecting arrows. And then everybody else has default equipment. I like that. A little bit of customization. We're, we're going full Legacy of the Void. Ah, uh, yeah. Seems good to me. What's this camp? Also imposing on the... Okay. It's just... Oh, we can change our color, guys. Colorful? Colorful? What color we gotta go? I mean, if it's Roman, purple is pretty... It's pretty Roman, right? Or red. Those are kind of like the color of Rome. I'm seeing a lot of pinks and a lot of purples in chat. Uh... I'm seeing more purples than I'm seeing pink. Yeah, I think we gotta go purple. It is the color of the Imperium. Let's do this. Head on over here. All right, Sergeant Peplum. Siege. The X logo moves across a treacherous gorge. They must... Oh, Legio, the ex Legio, not Loco. They must get through it and assault the enemy garrison. Let's do this. I know some people. You should always uh, fight the enemy in a terrain of your choice, oh, learning one. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Keep in mind that while you create treacherous paths to conquer the skeletal garrison, it lies at the end of this gorge and is well defended. I know that the mobile aesthetic and stuff is going to put some people off but honestly i think if a game is fun a game is fun right i don't i'm not too picky welcome again now that you master the basics it's time to learn how to unleash the power of the brush click the unit and then draw this is what i was looking for this is the thing that's interesting to me so we can make a formation Right? And all you do is you just draw like that and they'll move into formation. I think that's such a cool mechanic. And I can't believe I've never really seen that before. It's uh it's pretty it's pretty interesting. Let's make a giant U. Yeah. Do we reset this map to check if voice came back? What do you mean? Oh yeah, we can make a giant G because I'm Grant Does Games. Oh, it's brilliant. <laughs> He's amazed by our artistic ability. Make sure we use new skills to slay the enemy. I figure... Okay. Perfect. We're going to hit him with the ultimate maneuver. Alright. Go get him. We need more legions. We need a total of three. Beyond All Reason does it too. Hold right click and I haven't played that game yet. People keep asking me to, but I haven't I haven't bothered. Yes, sir. Two sheep are in danger. Enter drawing mode by pressing blah blah blah. Oh, why? 
Divide my four. Oh, okay. Hey, I like that that splits up so fluidly. That's really neat. We gotta save the sheep that we killed last mission. <laughs> and then they're just split up into two groups. Drag one drawing over the other. Oh, to unify the formations again. Okay. No! No! Stop, 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 stop. Okay, now that we know how to split them, we're gonna split like that, and then you become a... G oh, we ran out of people. We gotta... It's not, it's not going well. Oh, they have to physically touch each other. We can't move the giant grand games formation. <laughs> Time to recruit new troops to ensure missing success. Conquer the camp. Okay, we can conquer a camp. Let's go, brothers. We, we really do need more troops. All right, we got lots of guys. Let's make them into one happy family. A good strategist needs to select all of his units with one click. All right. <laughs> Every good strategy starts with F2. Now draw a formation on the... Or to unify. All right. I'm just going to draw that right now to make sure they're all together. And then we can click over here. And we can go... Oh, it's not working. It turns out that drawing G's diagonally on terrain is really hard. Who would have guessed? Oh no. <laughs> it became ugly. I mean, it started ugly, but it became uglier. It's just a... Oh no. I just wanted to connect it. I'm so bad. Just stop. Okay, we're gonna let you form that. And we're gonna grab you. No, I just want to move it. I'm so stupid. Okay, you're... <laughs> Come back to me. I love you. Please stop. I need you to all be... You know what? Let's just F2. I have, I have another strategy. Okay, we're gonna... There we go. We have made the cursive G. The dumbest of all letters. Let's go, boys. What? Why is it froze? Oh, because I froze it. No, I just want these guys to move over here. I keep clicking up here to try to move them. That's an interesting piece of incorrect feedback that I have. Uh, I keep clicking this in order to be like, hey, I want to select these units. Um, I think that's because that's what a lot of other squad-based games do. You know? If you want to play like Company of Heroes or something, that's what happens. Oh, my G's not doing too well. It's kind of become a blob. Wait, did we win? I didn't even kill them all. Okay. What? I didn't cross the bridge? <laughs> Wait. I feel like I failed terribly on this mission. I, I was just I was just trying to move forward and take those guys down. I didn't notice that this was the uh, the win mission thing. Uh, I'm gonna retry it and speed run it and just uh, get all the stuff. I gotta do 100 percent otherwise it's not true understanding. Uh, you should always fight off the air train blah 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 blah. Thanks bud space to skip and by space I mean click. No. We don't need to repeat the tutorial. I figured out how to move eventually. Okay, perfect. I don't know what was happening there. They're like teleporting. Oh, I guess that's just part of the setup, isn't it? Okay, I have a new strategy. Here we go. We're gonna grab these guys and we're gonna point in the direction of victory. gonna make it really easy to move my forces charge Wait, what's this do we need to do it we have to kill every enemy oh this is so hard because I'm impatient I guess what we could do is just click on this guy so I'm like one guy here one guy here 
then the rest of them just do their th okay I guess we're sending seven guys there and seven guys there I'm very bad at this <laughs> I think we killed them all perfect all right then that guy goes here this guy goes here and we're going to draw you into a squiggle squiggle formation is pretty good and then you guys are going to retain the I guess you're going the backwards arrow today perfect so we're going to see if the squiggle or the back arrow is better. All right, go guys. And then we can like rotate our squiggle and we can hit him like a boomerang. Yeah, this guy's going to get boomeranged. Oh wait, it's Australia. Uh, so we got to make it rotate the other direction. That's, that's how Australia works. I, uh, my camera was stuck on a rock. Yes, Alright, I'm excited to get some other units because these guys are boring. I mean, they're not boring, but they are exactly what they look like, melee guys. Does anyone know how hard this game is? Like, does it get challenging, or is it just a slaughter? Yes, I guess the, if it's challenging, it's also a slaughter. Okay, we didn't cross the bridge. No, the bridge. What happened? It became unbridged. Do we have to sit on this? I'll sit on it. I gotta get that chest. Okay, then we gotta... Gotta make our that. No, it's not. Perfect. And then you guys are going to go... Oh, we can't go over there. It's too dangerous. We'll accidentally win. Yes. You don't think a single person here knows what this game is? I mean, you you never know. You never know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a very smart person. Uh, so we're going to set these guys here. And then we're going to take this guy off of the bridge and see what happens. Yes. Oh, that's kind of a shame. I was hoping that they would get catapulted. <laughs> that would be, that would be the best. Unfortunate. All right, guys. Uh, as we're waiting to go over here and get the chest, what formation do we want for our thirty-three warriors of doom? Where? Oh, yeah, you guys go. A hammer. Yeah, okay, let's uh, let's Thor these nerds. I like that. And we want that, and it can have a little thing on the bottom that's bigger. We gotta really carefully trace back up and fill it on in. That's, uh... That's the hammer. Gumba I don't know what this is. It's, uh... The guideline for the hammer so you don't miss. Alright, guys, you go over here. Or, uh, it's Thor is going to be so excited that he's on our team now. Everyone knows that Thor is a Roman. Oh, dude, you could split against Banelings so easy with this. Why isn't this in StarCraft? It'd be great. You just click a bunch of places. That's genius. Box, please. <laughs> the box killed him. Oh, no. I'm so sorry, little dude. <laughs> Sword of Bellias, alright. Okay, you, 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 and you. What happens if we go over here? I don't know what this is. And then we're gonna hit these people with Mjolnir. Oh, we gotta kill everybody, though. Did they fall down, or did they just charge down? By the way, I guess it's fine. Actually, I like the fact that they can just drop off cliffs. Bop it. Okay, and then we rotate the hammer down onto them. Wait, no, don't win, don't win. There's still two people over here. No, 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 get off. Hey, it worked. We gotta, I gotta get my achievement. There we go. The, the hammer, hammer strat worked well. <laughs> it was actually pretty good. 
<laughs> you gotta protect your flank as you rotate. <laughs> Alright, I think we're gonna get archers after this mission. It's gotta be. Oh, we got the sword. Let's, uh... Continue. You've harvested enough resources to unlock powerful spell. Oh my gosh, we got the Spear of a Dune. Spell tree displays progression from low-cost spells to the most powerful ones. Select the arrows. Arrows are boring. What is this? I want I want blocks. <laughs> okay. Acquire arrows. Equip up to four spells in a battle. And so it just fires arrows. Exploding stuff. Catapult. Catapult Igni. Diopedes. Whoa! I want that one. Maybe. Offensive camp. Yeah, that's boring. Flaming turret? Eh. A whirlwind? Oh, flaming... Okay, okay. Our budget is four. We gotta, we gotta get up to flaming whirlwind power. Byzantine fire... Okay, we're going all in on fire strats. Let's do this. And then we got a we got a new stabby. What do you do? Sword of Peleus. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Enemies dealing or receiving damage from infantry are weaker against projectile. Wait. Enemies dealing or receiving damage from infantry are weaker against projectiles. So I need uh, we have to get the archer this game then. Like if it debuffs enemies against archers. First of all, I like that synergy. I think that's really cool. There's little stuff like that. Uh, but. Yeah, we're definitely getting archers, so I'm just going to throw that down. Because if they gave that to us and didn't give us archers, they'd be bad game designers. <laughs> like, why would that be a thing? That'd be silly. All right, lead the vanguard of the Imperial forces and destroy the watchtowers to secure their strategic potential in the war to come. We can change the enemy's color. They're going to be yellow. Conquer allied camps to recruit new units. Feast your eyes upon this site, O oh learning one. This four or three and a half towers watch over a crucial spot. You must conquer this terrain and continue your conquest. Be as swift as an arrow on the wind. Okay, we are definitely getting archers. There's no way we're not after all of this. Hey there, muggle. Time to do some magic for the first time. Let's test that new spell. All right, rain of fire. Remember that spells will only be available after recharging them with souls of units defeated in battle. All right. Careful, your spells can damage your own units. Be cautious. So this is a snowball mechanic then. You have to defeat enemies to uh, weaken up the enemies so that you can defeat more enemies to weaken up more enemies. Uh, you, it's Yeah, that's a really big snowball mechanic. Click the right panel to select a spell. Draw a line on the ground where you want to cast the spell. So let's... Uh... I was going to make a smiley face, but it didn't let me put it in multiple places. All the damage from your spell can be concentrated against a small area. Try drawing... Okay. I like that. Flexibility. His butt's on fire. Okay. <laughs> do I have to do it again? Is it unhappy that I didn't manage to kill it? There we go. Let's try again. Awesome. Yeah. Now you master the magic arts, but it will take you longer to master the art of war. Alright, let's make a smiley face. Oh, we got our big guy! Okay. Uh, yes, you right here. And then we want that. And we want one. Two, three. Actually, we want our big guy back because he could be—he could be the nose. Yeah. Yes, sir. He'll be right here. Perfect. Archers are much more powerful on tower. Oh, whatever. Let's uh. So we have to move all these individually, right? Oh, I'm so bad at this. I keep just clicking the wrong thing. Uh, no, okay, we're dying. I I need to actually go do something. One sec, we're being destroyed. 
here. Rain of fire, a uh, guy on the tower, whatever. We're just going to rub that on him. Please, little buddy. Going over here. What are these? Big bouncy rocks. Yeah, I keep having the same mistake. I keep clicking this because of Company of Heroes and Dawn of War. It's uh very different than what I'm used to. Wait, are you Sun Tzu? Are you just telling me this? You're not actually an enemy? Am I an idiot? <laughs> I thought you were an enemy. I thought you were a tower. But I guess this is just the only tower. Sure. I might not be very smart. Okay, we need to form a formation that looks decent. Uh, what should our formation be this game, guys? Someone give me something good. I'm sure that 80% of everything that has been drawn in this game has been phalluses so far, so the devs must be ecstatic when they hear that we're actually drawing real things instead. <laughs> Alright, we got 42 guys. Uh, a triangle. Okay. Um, so we grab these guys. We could get the... What? No. Okay, I don't care about you, dude. We need your guys. One, two, three. We can make a bow tie. Yeah. Okay, this is my strategy. And then you're yes, sir. gonna be right in there. I wish we could like merge them a little bit easier. All right, we're gonna hit them. Yeah, I wish you could be in the center. Yes, sir. So we send these guys over. And we start rotating it. This is the bow tie. I call it the bow die because it's going to blow these people out of the water. We need cavalry that can charge faster. Everyone's very slow. Get them, boys. Yeah, so if anyone can think of shapes that make bad puns, that would be the most important part, in my opinion. Man, my Centuria is almost dead. Let's uh send him over there. Oh, hello. Well, these guys deal with this. I don't think that this formation is nearly as good as the hammer. <laughs> is there anyone over here to drop arrows on? Oh, they're all patrolling. Can we drop it up here? Yeah, it's pretty good. I like that. Oh, wait, he, he don't got no jumps. Oh, no. Oh, he do got a spear, though. Can you guys get up here somehow? I don't know. I'm just going to leave it to you. Figure out what to do. He seems very bad with his spear. But I don't want to waste my Byzantine fire. And if he dies, he dies. Let's, uh... Hmm... We could draw a fire with our fire. Oh, no, we cannot. We can draw one squiggly line. Very short. So these guys are just patrolling around. If I just put a little bit of fire right here, are they just going to walk through it and die? Yes. Or walk through it and start hopping. Same thing. This doesn't seem to do as much damage as I hoped. It just makes them very uncomfortable for a bit. Well, I hope that, that damaged them enough. Oh, wait, he has to live? <laughs> I didn't notice that in the objectives. Um, okay, it just doesn't say that he has to live. I didn't know. I mean, why would you have a centurion if he wasn't allowed to die? Let's try this again. All right, buddy. You go over here. You guys uh, prepare the unit to fight. Uh, we're gonna... Oh, they're like in a little swirly. Yeah, we could give these guys a swirly. Yes, sir. Yes, 
this guy is like so in pain at all points in time. He's already 20% of the way dead. Oh, hero units in RTS, why? What a shameful performance. All right, blast this tower down. Why don't you help me, bud? I wish you would help me. All right, so archers have been really good in this game. So once we take this down, bud, you gotta, there you go, there you go. I'm gonna go back to the arrow formation because yeah, archers definitely really, really strong. So we're gonna do that and then. Oh no. It uh doesn't You know what? We're just We're just gonna cl let's just try again. I did not make a good What even It's not like I even made something inappropriate accidentally, it just looks dumb. Oh, a fork? Dude, you're a genius. Okay, okay, okay. Uh Yeah. We're going for the pitchfork mation. Let's do this. Three prongs of pain. And then before we go, I'm going to use this on these two guys because I don't like them. Not a fork. A fork? Wait, a fork. Oh, is that why it's called a fork? Because it has four? I never really thought about that before. Okay. One, two, three. Four. There. We've made a fork. Don't make me make a fife. <laughs> okay, boys. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's time for dinner. Yes, sir. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Make the spork formation? Dude, I need more troops before I can spork them. <laughs> uh. Oh no, the formation broke. I really wish there was an option to stay really rigidly in formation the entire time. That would be wonderful. So that we could truly... Ah, we gotta keep going. Prong them. The delicious dinner of Rome has destroyed you. <laughs> These guys, I guess they're just going to watch. All right, tower fell really quickly. Almost like this part was really easy and I somehow lost it. There we go. Right here. And then... Right here. Yes. I really do wish I was more artistic. Then I would truly be able to make some beautiful things in this game. I'm sure that there's amazing tactics. Like, I should be able to draw a lemon. If I could draw a lemon, then I could put it on the fork. Why is the lemon the thing that I thought of putting on the fork? That's a really good question. <laughs> Also, this game keeps taking control of my camera and is driving me a little bit nuts. It is just... You know what? I should be good. No, we didn't hit all of them. Whatever. We'll see what happens. It's what you get for being on the top of a structure. Alright, we gotta get the flag. Destroy all three towers, slay all enemies, parentheses, ten and parentheses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Where's the tenth? Oh! Look at him. He doesn't look that different. <laughs> banana form? Yeah, we could go banana form next time. Banana form sounds good. But I feel like you have to get some draconian troops. Or reptilian troops, if you want to do a banana. So you can do banana for scale. That makes the most sense to me. But I don't think that's going to be part of this game. Oh, wait. 
I keep accidentally winning the mission. No. Okay. <laughs> Let's power through this really quick. I keep accidentally winning the mission because I'm like... Uh, this looks like the final fight area in my head, like from a mission design perspective, you know? It looks like where you would go for a final boss fight or whatever. And yes, as a result, I keep thinking that's going to be the end and then I'm wrong. What? Place your units in prepare to fight. Why is this not a valid formation? Game? Oh, I just have to hit the fight button. Okay. I thought it just didn't like my formation. All right, we got to go really quick. Sorry, as you can tell, I'm not used to mobile games. <laughs> or games that have interfaces. You know what I mean. We don't have that. We don't have that. Yeah, we can bust through this. I think that we're going to bust... I think all these missions, when you know what to do, are doable in, like, a minute. You know? Just absolutely Hulk stomp your way through. One of the things I am getting the feeling of here currently is that the formation doesn't actually matter that much. Like, everything kind of devolves into a death blob anyway. And I think that's a shame, you know what I mean? Like, I'm just going to try this right here just by throwing stuff at it and see how it goes compared to everything else. Oh. I meant to hit both of them. I'm just bad at targeting. It worked! <laughs> Don't know why that happened, but I'll take it. Alright, yeah, you can just destroy everything. We're gonna take down this tower, and then we're gonna burn the people over here, and move on forward. Can I just drop arrows on them? Is there a thing that I have to stand on? To make this lower? Oh, he's standing on it. So I have to kill him with arrows, I assume. Instead of fighting him as a boss. I think that I just, I, uh, part of my confusion is I genuinely thought this guy was going to be a boss because he was, like, standing on a platform and is glowing. But in reality, it's, he's standing on a platform and that platform is keeping this drawbridge. You know? Okay, let's, uh. I'm not doing this right. You guys here. You guys here. And then click on the formation. We're going to draw a giant circle. And then we're going to surround the tower. So does this just kill the guy? Yep, that's not a boss. <laughs> that was my bad. Now you guys can join the circle. And then off. Oh, yeah. Line of fire off the circle. I hope that it doesn't light my own guys on fire. My hero guy is like really close to dying, so he's now officially chest man. Okay, we got a UFO. The fact that we didn't get archers on this mission is really confusing to me. Like, genuine. I'm. I guess I should ask do other people feel that I was making a somewhat genuinely decent inference with what I was thinking. We got the item that increases the damage that arrows deal. I understand that this is also arrows, but like, and then they talked about arrow. It just feels weird that all the arrow references were in reference to this one ability instead of the actual archer unit. But I guess I'm wrong. My thought process was 100% sound. Darn. Yes. Guess that's what happens when you say everything you think out loud. Conquer all the air. Oh god, we gotta go back here! No! Why do we even have to conquer this? <laughs> this game is too hard. Did we do the Triforce formation yet? No, we haven't. But I can try. Force. Oh, wait! We can just be wet? Oh my goodness, this game has tactical complexity far beyond that of what StarCraft can do. Incredible. Is there a button to speed? There is a button to speed up. Yeah, go. 
I don't like that it makes the music faster. It literally just makes everything faster. Okay, let's uh, pretend that we did that faster. Waddle my warrior. So what do we get here? Wait, where's my, oh, here's my UFO. It's for this guy. Shield of the God Mars. Uh, thanks to, thanks to the area surrounding the queen, there's a big chance to deflect arrows with the shield. What? Um. Thanks to the area surrounding the queen. You're not the queen, though, right? What does this mean? I understand this, but I don't understand the first line of this text. <laughs> just thanks thanks to the queen I really appreciate what the queen has done uh, okay let's uh let's keep going Vinny VD Burr defense seeking lands right for conquest a legion of Imperium reaches the snowy borders of their known world let's make them green this time Oh, our boat's like really fat. Look at that. <laughs> There's Okay, during the loading screen, there are left and right arrows, but the left and right arrows don't work until the game is finished loading. I feel like that is one of those, oh hey, we can give them something to read while they're loading the game. But, no, okay. I hope you packed a warm tunic. <laughs> I hope you packed a warm tunic for this exploration. This is Avalon, a land of magic and snow. Seems the Draugr Horde intends to conquer them, too. Place your units prepare to fight. Alright, so we want the Triforce? I can try the Triforce. So the Triforce is first a big triangle. I'm afraid I'm going to run out of troops. Yeah, we did it! Let's go! No! No, 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 no. <laughs> I've ruined the Triforce and given it a line. Oh, we got to do it again. Oh, I did so well the first time, too. Now it's hard to see. Hey, not bad. All right, let's go. Slay five enemies using spells. Slay ten enemies using spells. All right, I think that they want me to slay enemies using spells, so I need to get some spell energy. Wait, can we walk up here? That is a very aggressive cliff path. We need to rebuild a tower and slay the enemy waves. So I guess we're playing some defense today. I don't know why all of these guys go like, raw, raw, and this guy's like, yes, sir. He's like the only person that knows English. Why the Triforce? Why not the do or do not force? <laughs> oh, goodness. That's so dumb. I love it. Okay. I'm going to hit you with courage, wisdom. And uh, the other one, power? Yes. I'm pretty sure it's power. I, I I was like, is it power? Is it might? Whichever one Ganondorf had. Oh, we built that quick. Oh, he's he lives up there now. Oh, these guys are archers. Look at that. <laughs> I didn't even notice they were archers. Uh, I think that speaks a lot for the differentiation of the units at a glance. Uh, they're just very tiny, so it's kind of tough to tell. All right, so uh, we're going to split you guys up and... Oh. oh, that interface. This is not the greatest interface. I'm making an M for McDonald's. Ba -ba 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 -ba. We're going to destroy them. 
Oh, we sent all 40 of them up there. Yeah, you know what? Why not? This is funny. <laughs> Just as it should be. Uh, yes, sir. Because you're going to chill here. And then <laughs> whatever this is, is happening. We have to slay a hundred enemies? Okay. That was a lot of enemies. Cool. I hope that this goes well. Wait, we can put people here. Or maybe this is rocks? Are you rocks? No, you're jugs. I don't want your jugs. All right, we've killed two out of ten enemies with uh, spells because I got to get my bonus objectives. Is there anything like to find over here? Yeah, this is not the most exciting mission. I mean, these guys are having a great time. <laughs> they kind of remind me of Pikmin right now. And that is a very good thing to be reminded of. He just a little guy is having a time. this it's a very fog shrouded town and I'm just looking around to make sure maybe there's something in here I didn't expect to be able to go in here <laughs> oh there's nothing in there I'm not seeing anything All right, let's try a little bit of that, a little bit of that, and a little bit of that. Oh, well, I guess, I guess the guys up on the tower didn't work. Wait, chest where? You can't just say the word there. <laughs> That's not helpful. <laughs> I, I want it. I want it. Okay, I give up. Oh, it's just in the middle of... The, did they drop it? Or has it just been there the entire time and I'm an idiot? Both could be true. It probably was there the entire time. I like you guys when you're up here instead. It's more funny. Here comes the final wave. Steady and find your courage. Oh, Dionysus's cup. That can't be the final wave. I have to kill eight guys with spells, okay? You need to send more stuff, because I only have two spell activations left. I gotta get my achievement. I've been so busy looking for boxes. Alright, here's the, here's the plan. Actually, where do they spawn? Can I just camp them with the fire? It says 43, so there's still going to be a lot of guys. Okay, so we're just going to... I just feel like fire is not actually a great tool against the undead, you know? I could be wrong here, but like... I've never really thought of burning a skeleton as a particularly useful strategy. Oh, this is really bad. I'm not going to get my achievements. There's not much to do here. We're just kind of waiting and hoping that I can get more things. There's 18 guys here. Okay, blast them. Come on, rain of fire. Come on, buddy. There we go. Okay, can we get five of them? We need to make sure that we hit... We need, like, a PhD for this. No, they stop moving! No, why did they stop moving? I got defrauded. Here, you guys move here. Stop killing guys. No, okay. Everybody's dead. I failed. I... 
<laughs> I don't think that the Wall of Fire is a very good spell. It doesn't do anything. Like, the other spell kills people. Let's, uh, let's just continue. We got the box. That's all that I care about. Loot is the only thing that matters in this world. Uh, can we... How do I get my new... Where's the spell menu? Okay, let's check this out. Uh, allies near the king recover health over time when they're not in combat, or... When death is near, fiery explosion of fury invades your Imperator, damaging close enemies and regenerating health once per battle. I mean, this seems good. I'm gonna keep it on that. Spells. Tornado. Acquire. What is this? Spear. Okay, so we can fire like rods from the gods. I think I want to go for flaming death catapult. Oh yeah, that's flaming death catapult. Is this also flaming death catapult? Everything is fire. No, that's like actually a catapult. No, I want to throw flaming rocks. I think that's better. Yeah, we'll go with that. Did we just take another boat over here? All right. Okay. We're not continuing our campaign, we're reinforcing it. The stronghold keeps a strong grip on the land. Here we go, fortress breaking. This is what I'm here for. Careful, it's watchtowers. We'll see you if you approach too much. Fast strike on the tower before approaching the fortress could be of the essence. As you once said, O Imperator, divide and conquer. I say as I said, I never said that. Uh, we got 10 archers, 24 meleeers, and a stibby stabby man. So you guys, okay, we're gonna do the uh, reverse smiley. This is the plan. So this is gonna be this part of the smiley, and then we click on the archers. We're going to be this, and oh, there we go. Now this is a smiley faced formation if I've ever seen one. And you are the nice little nose. To war my smiling soldiers. I like this mission. I mean, there's like multiple routes to take. There's camps over here, things to think about. Tower looks pretty good. Yeah, this ain't bad. Oh, no, I'm drawing again. Well, I have made a line. My smiley face has been destroyed because I keep drawing. Okay, guys, so you might think that this is a frown, but it's actually an upside down smiley. Okay, so let's uh, see just like this. There you go. I know it can be very confusing when it's the, it's the other way around because it looks like, oh no, he's unhappy and he has, he's unhappy because he has eyes on his chin, but that's not how it's actually working. Very complicated stuff. I understand your confusion. Yes, sir. Smile our way to victory. I don't know why I decided that the eyes are lines. That's not what most eyes look like. Honest question, why does this game have a better campaign than Age of Empires 4? <laughs> that's, that's a good question, sir. Uh... Oh, let's get... Maybe the nose right there. Perfect. Ooh, the archer's firewall moving. Look at that. Get him, boys. I don't understand why the armor is so textured. Like, it is needlessly textured on these guys for how small they are. <laughs> uh... I, I keep I want to say something right here, but I can't because I'm NDA'd. But I've worked on a project recently that has the same issue, where uh, there's like these really really nice textures, but the units are very small, and then you can't really see the details. All right, fire towers light your archers with fire, allowing you to build more using. Oh, you can build more using your spells. I mean, okay, perfect formation. <laughs>
Yeah, I think that's what I want. The one guy constantly trying to get on and then falling off. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> okay, let's try to rebuild. Oh, what do we do, though? Uh, I guess we gotta split you into... But two and three don't divide. Hmm. I don't know what to do. You can't give a guy three eyes. That doesn't work. Maybe we can give him like a beauty spot right here. Beauty spot archer. This is becoming way too much to micro. Can we shift grab these guys? Can I move all my formations at once basically? Oh, we can make him a Cyclops. That's genius. By the way, the enemy is like coming in mass to murder me. <laughs> I don't care. All right, we got a Cyclops temporarily. We need to turn this frown upside down, though. Like that, that. Cyclops formation. What does this do? I haven't read it. It's just a jug. We're either going to, like, put burning oil on the ground, or our opponents are going to be very well hydrated. I'm not sure which is going to happen. Probably burning oil. No, I just hit him with jugs. Okay. That wasn't one of the things I was expecting. Get, get him, boys. Stop taking my camera game. It's mine. Alright, what do we want to burn? There's some guys up here. There's some... Um, I just want to make sure all those are taken care of. Right, I think we've dealt with everything here, which means we can go back to being a Biclops. Which is good. Why are there Cyclopses but no Triclopses? I feel like I've heard of a Triclops maybe once, and it was in something like Yu-Gi-Oh. It sounds like a Yu-Gi-Oh thing. Oh my gosh, look at all these guys over here. Okay, you guys, hemisphere. You guys, eyes in the skies. And what about like quad clopsters? Well, that'd be lobsters at that point. Okay, you can't get a uh, quadcopter and and qua uh, cyclops with four eyes <laughs> because you end up with a lobster. That is not what I expected. Oh, we got a we got a throw, Emi. Oh, that did too much damage. Can we? I want to throw at the gate. I want to open the gate. <laughs> it's bouncing. Oh, these guys cannot rescue this. There we go. So I have a plan. I know what we got to do here. We're grabbing this, which means we have to capture this fort, right? So we're going to... How do you capture something? With a... Pokeball. It's perfect. And you can be the little button in the middle. <laughs> I have to say, I do, this is not like the most strategically deep game in the history of mankind, but I am having way too much fun with just dumb things. All right, here we go. Gotta catch them all. I mean, that doesn't look terrible. If we could fill one of them in, that would be ideal. But I don't think we can. All right, let's figure out how big my jugs are. Oh. Well then. That's pretty good. <laughs> uh, let's see. Like right here because that guy's gonna get wrecked. Yeah. <laughs> Sick. Set the formation around him. 
Oh, these are those are the guys. I really hope my men are fireproof because I'm about to pyro NATO. Come on. We're we're villains in a movie, just surrounding and watching with one guy fighting at a time. Let's do this. Archers are like hiding in a corner. I'm too scared of the pyro tornado. We draw it? What do we do? Hey, I like this ability. Can I move it? Ah, oh, it's a shame. It doesn't seem to be destroying my foes. Oh, there's like enemies over here. I didn't even notice. <laughs> oh, well, we captured this. Did I find a chest? Does anyone know? Wow, I didn't do anything right this time. Eh, whatever. I just want more units at this point. I I keep getting distracted by dumb shapes. <laughs> so you are landmine. You are allies, and then this gives me Explodus Porcus. Okay. That seems like exploding pigs. I said that I wanted this, and that I proceeded to exactly... Oh, uh, it just builds a wall. Walls are for losers. I don't need that. How many guys does this give? Nah, I don't want them. Three? This is fine. This is the... Uh, this is bad, though. Yeah, we'll get this. Why not? Wait, I got rid of my landmines. Uh, oh, there's so many options. Yeah, we want the landmines. What am I talking about? I was going crazy. This is very important stuff. Do I need anything here? Oh, now we can actually have this combo. Take a look at that. The area surrounding the queen, I still don't, I don't know. Let's go. I Okay, guys, you have to make sure that I find Mr. Box this time. Uh, I'm going to mark them red. Because then they'll be on fire more easily. Because red is the color of fire. Behold, these cowardly minions race towards their master. Don't underestimate them, though. Branches are weak on their own, but together... Okay. Send your cavalry of dashing Altaris to chase them up and hunt them down before it's too late. We get cavalry. Can we make a horse with our horse? Okay. Here's the horse. Here's the head. Perfect. Let's charge, man. I need more horses. It's so beautiful. <laughs> oh, it might be bad. Oh, look, it's the perfect formation because that guy will be on the point. Yeah. Square shaped buttons will remain pressed once activated. Cool. Let's uh rotate this. Oh, six enemies over here, though. Well, I mean, they can't outrun it. Let's uh, put the legs of the horse down here to kick him in the face. <laughs> Did I say horse-shaped buttons instead of square-shaped? I might be an idiot. Oh, no. Tally-ho! Oh, we tallied them. Look at that. They have been tallied. Cavalry deal greater damage at high speed. Oh, I like that. As they should be. These aren't quite uh, cavalry from... What is that game called? Uh, Battle for Middle Earth 2. They don't quite have that impact, but I like the fact that they run fast and then they smash. 
It's a good way to live. I do like that people get sent halfway across the galaxy when they die. As it should be. You can make a like football game out of this. I don't know enough about football, but I assume it's very similar to this. It'd be kind of like Blood Bowl. Except not as good. We got it. Where are we going next? Oh, friends. Wait, button. I need button. Oh, this is quite a puzzle. What is this? Okay, the golden shoop. Wait a moment. Come to the golden shoop. Become my friend. I don't know what to do with you. How do, does anyone know how to golden shoot? Look at him, he's just bouncing. Uh, let's... Oh, those look like my allies. What's over here? A lot of people? Can we just kill the boss? Skeletor's over here. <laughs> it did decent damage. We have to, oh, we have to protect the shiny sheep, I see. So the enemy are evil and they will raid the shiny sheep. Do we just walk over here? I'm not seeing a button. But I could be blind. Oh, yeah, here's a button. I don't think we just walk over there. I, I mean, they're trying. Let's see what they do. Get stuck on the rocks. Perfect, let's go get this button. You gotta put your little hoof on it. Oh, no. How could they? Get him, guys. I gotta stop him. Come on, faster. <laughs> Perfect. I'm gonna take the N over here. I'm gonna take the O across the bridge. And then we're going to... Man, I really just want to have my whirlwind of fire. I can't read that. It's too small text. I can't imagine how you read that on mobile. It has to be a different interface or smaller or bigger because like this is a uh, very small text. Okay. They're spawning some guys. There we go. Friendship. We got you. Oh, we could spell like big words this time. Guys, what word do we spell? I know that you usually magic spell, but we can word spell today. We could spell an entire four letter word. Okay, friendship is a little bit long. <laughs> four letter word. Make the GGG logo. I tried that earlier and it didn't work so well, but we actually have more guys this time, so we could give it a go, go, go. Okay. So you're going to be a G. Perfect. And then let's split these guys into sets of 12. Perfect. That's. Uh, yeah, you know what? We're going to have to deal with what we got to deal with. Um, one G might be differently sized than other G. Oh, that is not enough. We need more friends. Okay, join up together again. 24. So we want... Lot. Oh, if... Oh, I figured it out. If we go point, point... Is that 12? Yeah. Now we can make the G. <laughs> it's... Wait, we really need about 15 guys per control group for a G. Okay, we got giant grand range. That's kind of what we got going on right now. Let's go. 
Got to rotate it. G. 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 Oh, but we got to do the logo. Yeah, so you're going to be like that. Oh, if we have them barely touching. Are they all three together now? And then just like the GIF version. I can't get them to touch each other. Oh, because they're different unit types. All right, Skeletor. I'm gonna hit you with that jug. Oh, we can pig ya, pig ya. That ability was not that good. Wait, a blacksmith? Oh, we do have these guys linked together. We just need that one linked. How do we link it? Link, please. It's touching. I guess we can only have two formations linked together, which seems like a huge oversight. Now we have to go giant. Grant Games. Is there like one enemy left? Not even that. Is this slate? Oh, 10 enemies with spells. Do I have anything I can destroy with spells? Because I keep getting... I keep trying my best. But that is... It's too hard of an objective. Because I'm distracted and my pigs don't kill enough people. Mm. Oh, the box! Is there a box? Is anyone seeing it? Is it in here? Guys, there's gotta be a box. On the right eye. Oh my gosh, look at that, it's a box. Good thing we have these gavelry to go. I will, I will get this box faster than the speed of time. Can we kill these? I don't know if this kills them. Okay, it does. I mean, you gotta experiment. That way we'll learn for next time. Please, get the kills. Yeah, 10 out of 10, perfect. Box. Perfect. We got the Trojan horse itself. Let's go. <laughs> I saved everything that we needed, such as... Hey, birds, look at them. Where are we going? Oh, is it going to turn into a defense mission? No. Wait, did we have this guy the entire time and I forgot about him? That seems likely. Listen, I don't like him because I can't make formations out of him. He's just, he needs friends, okay? Then I'll be a lot more interested in him as a person. It's not my fault. More spells. What can we get? What is this? Medics? Are you kidding? I'm gonna buy a catapult. What is this? That's just a flaming turret. Offensive camp. Regular turret. None of those are really exciting to me. The spear is kind of cool. And the flaming catapult. Yeah, we'll go for this. I'm not really a fan of the pigs. They seem kind of meh. Put the enemies on fire, deflecting arrows. Oh, Trojan Horse. When they die, cavalry units respawn with a more playful mount. Okay, first of all, <laughs> I feel like the focus here is supposed to be the funny mount, but uh, is this reincarnation for my cavalry? That sounds insane. What they have right near, if the cavalry is close to its maximum speed, double the damage and 
push of the next attack. Oh, that sounds, that's really good though. But you know, respawning cavalry also sounds good. An expedition led by Imperador himself has breached a mysterious land beyond the mists. Face their hardened inhabitants in a clash of civilizations. Oh, they're Sam. It's Sam. Sam R.I. Incredible. Let's go. Are we floating back to the same? Oh, no, we're go We're going real far. Oh, no, we're not going back to the same continent. We're going halfway around the planet. Oh, it works. It no longer works. <laughs> you just got to click it quick. You've, deri you've arrived on the land of Yomi. This mystical island is ruled by a civilization of artful warriors known as the Kyokai. To establish camp here, you'll have to face them in battle, just like ever. Okay, it's the same thing every time. Beware of their tactical genius. They have samurai. What we got here? We got a little horsey dudes. I like that the horsey dudes rock like a rocking horse. Hmm. Guys, I need inspiration. What are we making? What are we doing? I don't think I have enough people to make my own samurai. Unfortunately. A star? Alright. That doesn't look good. Yes. Oh, no. Um. Here, go back to your friends. Yes, sir. No, please, join everyone. I have fatally wounded. It says I have 60 guys. Well, now it says I have 30. Where are my other guys? I was so confused. There was a 60 over there for a bit. I'm not, I'm not wrong, right? And it only gave me half of a formation. I'm so confused. Okay, the hide in the mist. Keep my eyes open. Did I lose half of my army? Because I drew a star poorly? I was just trying to <laughs> trying to do what chat wanted. Okay, um we gotta rethink our our composite. You know what? Let's just hit the restart button and see what happens. How many units are we supposed to have? I don't wanna lose half of my army. <laughs> we can skip this. Fight No, it is thirty. Why did it show sixty for a bit? It definitely showed sixty. Actually, here's how I want to do it. Alright. Coat hanger formation. Wait a moment. Okay, okay, okay. No, 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 no. No, okay. We do this as the triangle. And then we have these guys become... The question mark that goes on top of the coat hanger. Merge them together. And. We can't merge them together. I had. I could have sworn that I had cavalry merged with archers before. In last mission. And I could not figure out how to redo that. Oh there we go. It's just a little janky. Alright ha coat hanger formation go. Perfect. <laughs> uh, Kokai forces hide in the mist. Whatever, whatever. They're like sending big old bombs over there with their explodey gun. Very powerful, but we can we can grab them on the hook right here. I appreciate the fact that you can come up with the world's dumbest things and they're somehow somewhat strategically sound. Like, I'm pretty sure that no other RTS will allow you to make the coat hanger formation and then be successful with it. It's that combination of things that really is beautiful. 
Oh gosh, we gotta stay on the button, but we also gotta blast these guys, so we'll rotate our coat hanger. So they want us to kite enemies into them. What is happening over here? Oh my goodness. How do we unmortar? Just thinking logically, it isn't a terrible formation. Yes, it is. It's a coat hanger. Look at this. How could you say this is not objectively a terrible formation? It's the worst. It's really bad. I appreciate your willingness to lie for me, but no, it's actually just terrible and that's okay. Okay, these guys are hitting this, so if I drop my jugs over here and blow them on up. Oh, those scattered to the winds. If we drop Odin's spear over here, then they're all gone. So that's going to stop, which is kind of a shame. I actually think it'd be really cool. That stops it, doesn't it? Yeah, okay. It'd be really cool if we had to make formations in order to dodge these things. I think that'd be a lot more fun than just blasting that, you know? It's kind of a shame. Here's the chest. It's got 40 dudes near it. Here's uh, question marks. Can I just attack the question marks? Absolutely can. I'm not sure about that one, Chief. <laughs> Alright, so these guys are going to be hung up on our coat hanger. Oh, they just charged down the cliff. Okay. I'm not used to that yet. Come on, guys. You gotta rescue the cavalry before they die. Uh, we gotta pull the coat hanger back just a little bit. Okay, here we go. We got the pyro... thing? I have literally no idea what's over here. Oh, boss. Alright. I mean... Okay, so speaking just from my feelings right now, I honestly feel like these abilities detract from the game. Sort of Damocles, okay. I feel like the the best part of this game is making silly setups, but so much of your combat power is off of this random secondary mechanic that is not like particularly inspired and is super, super powerful. I, it's a shame. I would rather have like twice as many guys and not have the top bar personally. What? Are we bringing this now? Okay. If we if we gotta do it, we gotta do it. Oh, maybe if we use the hook of the coat hanger, it'll be easier to move it about. Yeah, perfect. This is how it's gotta go. Wait, how do we open this? Do we just attack it? Yeah, we just attack it. This is the job for the bottom of the coat hanger. Da da da. I want to see if I can roll this over an enemy. <laughs> I don't think I can, but I would really like to be able to. Wow, this formation is not good for siege work. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Wait, this guy can just open it? Wait, can you just walk this way, please? All right, sure. Then we go and we're just gonna hold. Please. And we gotta go up slightly. No, 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 no. Come on around. This isn't gonna do anything, but I really want it to. And it's very difficult to control. No, okay. oh, you, no, okay. Um. I give up. Let's go put this right here. Oh, hello, boss. Wait, no! Why? 
I didn't. I. <laughs> Jeez. Oh my goodness. Oh, I need to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Protoss for the bits. Thank you. Technic GG for the sub and Derpy Turtle for the sub. Um, I don't like the capture point system. I, I really, really enjoy the silly formations drawing thing. That is truly the pinnacle of the game for me. And I wish it didn't have the other mechanics. All right, we're going to go pink warriors. <laughs> they can't be pink too? Are you for real? Why not? It's It's illegal to be the same color. Do we not have enough dye? Can we not afford it? Come on, guys. <laughs> They're already skeletons. They have enough dye. Equally guilty are those who advance against orders and those who retreat against orders. Okay. Sure. Keep that in mind while you command this brute across the path. If he survives the incoming danger of enemies and terrain, he'll pro uh, prove to be a worthy... Proved to be worthy of the gladiatorial oath. Oh, we just have one guy. Is his name Scissor? Like the Pokemon? Alright. Place my units. Prepare to fight. Alright guys, what uh... What shape should I draw? Yes, sir. Yeah. Ooh. Here he goes. <laughs> Let's uh, hit the fast forward on... Oh, he does hit hard. All right. Here we go. This looks like some friends. Oh, it's more of the same guy. He seems totally balanced. There we go. Much better. We still don't have much we can draw right here. What do you think we can get with a seven guys? Uh, Lucario Mortal 123, thank you for the sub. A triangle? We already did the Triforce, which is, like, many triangle. No, oh, my men! Oh, he fell off! He's so dumb! We gotta be careful. Okay, they push each other. We gotta be careful. We gotta make a squiggly line. This min maxes the surface area so that they don't push each other. There we go. Come on, boys. It's time to squiggle. And we just set up the squiggly line like this. And it's going to be just like recess. Okay, guys, we're going on a field trip. Everybody stay in line. If you guys don't disturb any of the other classes on your way, then we'll go. <laughs> we'll be able to stay out for two minutes extra. Eliminator, thank you for the five tier one community subs, my dude. I appreciate it. Yes, Let's just jug them. Because we are the juggernaut. Got him. I can't wait to follow this straight path and not be able to find the chest. Speaking of not being able to find... How do I must blur? Can I, can I knock it down? Am I gonna learn something about physics today? Yay! Yeah. The Pompeii Pizza. Yeah. How long does it have to be before you can make fun of a tragedy in a mobile game? <laughs> I mean, obviously this one's been a good 2,000 years, so I think it's fine, but... That spear lacks oomph. You know what I mean? Like, this, uh, explodey thing actually feels pretty good. But then that spear is just like... That's it. Alright, there's a couple more guys over here. Oh, they got over here. Why aren't they using that? Uh-oh. It's not gonna get this guy, is it? Hey, got that guy. Oh, there's like a boss fight going on. Can I? 
This, like, absorbs people, right? Yeah. Retreat! Throw him off! Throw him off! Oh, why is he going this way? It didn't work! Yeah, go in the... F yeah! Oh, this guy can get out of it. That's a shame. I thought we were going to be cool for a moment. See, that's actually the type of ability that I would prefer in this game, is a purely movement-oriented one. Right? <laughs> Alright, camera. <laughs> Where are we going? <laughs> uh, complete the level without casualties. I could've, but I ran my guy off the cliff. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we like 360 no scoped at the end. I would love to just have like abilities that pull people around or knock them back. I was going to say up and I realized that doesn't mean what I think it means. Um, that sort of a thing. Like, that's why I'm going to get limes. Limes? Is it because it's made out of limestone? Or is it because when we have this great fortification, we will never get scurvy? Actually, that looks kind of funny. I like it. Mm -hmm. I don't like the spear. The spear is pretty meh. We have this. No, wait, do we? Oh, we don't have that. Why don't I have the giant flaming death rock? It's going to be blue today. The blues versus the greens. It's just going to be like the chariot races of old. Uh, I believe the biggest sporting riot in history was uh, because of the blues versus the greens. If anybody can confirm that, if any history buffs are in the chat, uh, it was uh, Byzantine, right? And they just like, <laughs> yeah, the Nika riots, is that it? How many people, <laughs> if anyone knows how many people got uh, a bad day, I would appreciate knowing because it was ridiculous. It was just because it was like the modern version of my sports team lost, so I'm going to go flip cars. Tens of thousands, yeah. Chariot races were hardcore. Uh, Tanto Pile was once the resting ground of a mighty troop that fought against the roaring sea of countless enemies. I don't like how fast the text is. Now the restless spirits will face you and your small number of soldiers. Oh, we're doing 300. That's cool, actually. I like this. I like this a lot. What a what a smart way to do things. Okay, we're going to... 30,000 from the sports-based riot. That's crazy. All right, uh, what do we do? What do we do? We have 20 archers that need a formation, and then we have these guys. Um, I'm running out of things that are easy. I'm not artistic, so <laughs> I'm not good at drawing. Let's see. Draw the number 300. All right. Let's give this a go. Three. No. Yes, oh. Stop. Go back with your friend. Please. There you go. I don't have enough men. We can't draw the number 300. <laughs> we got... We got 30. <laughs> uh, okay. Are you guys... Bound together in eternal servitude? Oh, they're coming. <laughs> move the threes. Move the zeros. Maybe we'll get more guys at this camp. I hope so. Oh, did I do it? Did I join them together as father and son? I don't know what that is. Go, 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 go. Ah, uh, ba, 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 ba. Why is one horse up here? Oh, can only be opened by one of the leaders. Okay. 
I didn't know that we could carry this, but sure. Leader, open this box. Yeah, sir. Wait, can we not go down? Do we have to go on an adventure? Yeah, sir. Okay. This is, oh gosh, this is going to be quite the quest to get this box. Okay, you come on up here. Hit that square. We have to deal with the enemies from 300. Where's the enemy? Oh yeah, there they are. We have these gladiator guys. We're gonna absolutely destroy them. Wait, people can jump off cliffs in this game. Give me, give me a sec. I. If we just do this, let's uh, let's do some real tactics for a bit because that sounds kind of fun. I know. I'm sorry. But you up here. This is a point that needs to be not taken. 60 enemies with spells. Ugh. Move this over. Oh, they're so slow. This guy has to go over here and do his little thing. So these guys, if we just do this, they're going to charge off, right? What? No! Why can everyone else... Okay, one of the guys figured out what I wanted. That's a shame. What's this button? Oh, a button that stops the camera from moving. Okay, we gotta we gotta be really careful with this man. Go, go, go. Over here. No, 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 don't stand on the thing, you fool. Alright. It's only specific cliffs we can jump off. That is a darn, darn shame because that would be really cool. Also, our guy is mostly dead. So can we just uh, go like, LOL? Here's a wall. Yes. Yay. Why did they decide to go to war against this pig? Because it messed up my timing with my explodies. I'm gonna pull these guys back. We have to kill 60 guys with spells. My goodness. It's gonna be impossible. Yeah, sir. Particularly with these formations. Um, Here, why don't we... Why don't we turn you into something a little bit more beautiful? How about... You can be Mr. Squiggles. And then behind you can be Mr. Wiggles. And then you, Mr. Horseman, are going to charge to your death. There we go. Wait, how'd they get through this? I wasn't paying. Oh, they jump? Can I just put more here? I don't want them to be able to jump over it. That seems lame. I'm not, like, totally convinced by this ability, just to throw that out there. If everybody can just jump over it, I'm not sure what the point is. Alright, here they come. Let's see if we can get 50 kills. Please. I guess. I mean, 58. 59, 60. Oh, I was going to try to wall him in. It's, uh... <sighs> These abilities are just... They're so broken. They're just so ridiculous. It's... Actively... Detracting. You know? Because I gotta get the... 
Gotta get the bonuses done. Which means I gotta kill people with the spells, but the spells are so- What is happening with this guy? He's Mr. Orbits. My goodness. He's like undead Elon Musk. He just wants to orbit. Oh, I missed. Like, none of that wave made it over. Besides... I really can't tell what's going on with this guy. Is it like a bone shield? Of other bone bros? Oh, he's bringing me my trophy! Thanks, buddy. Okay. I wonder how much more there is left of this. I know it's in early access. It can't go on forever. Does anyone have any idea? I've got these items. Uh, Pompeii Pizzas. Heroes explode after dying. Heroes enter rage when they have low... Oh, yeah, let's get exploding. Spear of Destiny. Allies near projectile impact receive a temporary attack boost. Yeah. Oh, 9 of 12 missions done, it says in the bottom left. Oh, you're right. Okay, yeah, let's blast through these. Let's do it. This is a fun little game. Uh, definitely, I this is about the point where I'm like, okay, I think I've seen what it has to show. And I don't think I would ever play more of it after this, but I think that it's an enjoyable enough experience. It's very cute. And I do like the formation idea. However, I think that it is a bit tarnished by the fact that... Oh, for too long the Skeleton Barbarians have occupied our amphitheater. Now it's time to give them a little spectacle worth remembering. I think the top bar really dampens the formation, and the fact that the formations break really easily and everything kind of blobs. They're as trickier as ever. Yeah, yeah more units, more rigid formations, and less top-down powers is really what I would go for here. Okay, we got the Centuria. What do we do? Where do we go? What do we make? Oh, we're at a dock. Okay. Uh, I got it. Drawing inspiration from my natural surroundings. I need to target these guys. So you guys will be the boat. And then you guys... Oh. Will be the sail... Perfect. And then you guys will be the little rudder with these guys. Yes. Yeah, look at that. And then we got you to be the guy up here that says, Avast ye buckies, I see things. Perfect. I really hope that these links together. Uh oh. I have completely undid all of my hard work in life. This keeps happening. Okay, please join up. I really cannot figure out how to reliably get these guys to be friends. Maybe I have to go like, they have to go a really long distance and then they join together. No. <laughs> Does anybody have any idea <laughs> how to do this? I just want my boat, but every time that I've successfully done this, it's been by accident. <laughs> we might not be boating today. All right. We're going to have to use our sick APM to make the boat thing work. Go, 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 go. Perfect. It's beautiful. Actually, we gotta, gotta rotate this boat so it doesn't get sunk. Yeah. Go, go, go. So what we gotta do there at the amphitheater... We got a little cannon thing we can build over here. We got Skeletor over there. 
And then eh, we go up here. But at this point, do bonuses even matter? I don't think they do. Like, we have spells. We're... <gasps> I don't know why it worked, but we're boating. Let's go. It's time to float. I'm just charging in. I don't care. It's probably going to work. Actually, we shouldn't charge in. We should at least rebuild this. We can turn our boat into a galleon. I knew it would work eventually. Maybe this guy just needs to be here. He's like on the boat. Let's get our pyronado. Let's get... Uh... So can we just surround this boss? Yeah, kind of. Oh, where's the camera going? I guess we're over here now. Thanks, game. That's exactly what I wanted. Oh, it's over here. What's over here? I've found it. And we get one guy. Uh, no, because we'll break our boat. We can't. Oh my gosh, it worked! <laughs> He's too stupid! He can't get out. Let's bury him. There we go, I'm happy. This ability is wonderful. He's so mad. Alright, set sail for pain. Let's do him in. Oh, he escaped. Wow, this guy is getting absolutely shredded. You can't back up anymore, because I built a wall. All the items are like passive bonuses and it aren't that exciting. I've learned. We're just gonna finish these last two missions. I'm pretty happy with the boat. The boat was actually incredible. Probably the best ability that's ever been in a game. We need two more things. To finish this campaign, we need exactly two more things. What do you guys think? What should we art? The Ram Breaks the Wall. Incredible mission name. Uh, we'll go pink again. PVG. Two hammers. Do we have such power? The Terran logo? Oh <laughs> my dude. I cannot make that. A goat. I can make a goat. You've entered Erebus, land of the undead. Its bony rulers will try to expel you from here. Face their many soldiers and advance in your path of conquest. Be wary, the closer you are to the heart of the empire, the harder they will fight. The uh, text speed is like really inconsistent compared to the text duration, which makes me think that it is all timed out for a different language. I don't know what these devs originally are, but it definitely is timed out not for English because sometimes the really long things are very fast and then sometimes the really short things are there for a long time. Okay, what do we say? Oh, uh, yeah. So, a goat. Someone else asked for a ram and that's very similar to a goat. It's really more of a sheep though. That's a sheep body. It's too fat for a goat. What have I done? I messed it up. I guess we're making a sheep now. He's got a... Is that a sheep face? Yeah, sheep enough. Sheeps have tail. Yes, sir. This game made me question whether sheeps have tails for a second. Yeah, that's pretty good. Perfect. Fight. All right, now I have to figure out how to link all these up. Attach the head. Attach the tail. 
and I'm just gonna let everyone get to their positions because that seems to be when they link up best. Is it a sheep? No. Maybe it's gotta be a long way. Like if we go all the way over here. Really, really quick. Attach the head, rotate the head. Perfect, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. How, how gorgeous. And then you right on over here, perfect. And then you are going, you're like the little collar around the neck. Yeah, beautiful, so that the farmer can know who exactly you are. You're sheep number Roman. Hopefully this has worked. Who do we blast? I think we just blast the wall defenders. Seems good. Ah, the devs are in Spain. Interesting. What can we do here? What are they doing? Why did you... Why are you doing this? It's very rude. Okay, we gotta see if we can protect this. I'll stop him. Oh my gosh, he can fire over it. Okay, did we make a shoot? Oh, yeah, we just have to send them a really long way and then it makes it. He can be a foot this time. How do we save this tree that's being brutalized? I found the weakness with the sheep, and that is that the archers go in front. What are you gonna do, bro? You can attack the tree anymore? No. Does it get taller if we build it like this? Sick wall. <laughs> Absolutely cool. Oh, the sheep lost its head because all the archers are gone. Unfortunate. We're, we're going to be the Dulahan sheep for today. Slay 40 units with spells? My dudes. There has to be a defense segment after this. There's no way there isn't. Which means that losing my archers was terrible. Oh, guys, guys, uh, no, okay, we gotta rotate it so that the, we poke him with the tail, because that's where all my powerful units are. Get him. Thank you. Need some people over here. We need you over here. Seems you're about to be surrounded by enemies. Hold on, harvest some souls to help me out. Uh, harvest some souls? Excuse me? Enemy waves approaches. Okay. I don't want to lose. We got to go over here, though. I don't know what these buildings are, but we got to build them. It's in the name. Let's, uh... Buy some time. Uh, that's a tower. Not too useful. This guy can actually throw a spear. So that's okay. Uh, we, we need an actual formation here. I have five guys. Oh, no. I was supposed to have more than this. Let's see, where are they coming from? It's just a couple guys right now. Oh, don't jump over the wall. We need you guys over here. Okay, this is a lot, so we're just gonna fire the tornado. Scoop them all up. Arrow them. Enjoy your burger. Oh my gosh, we could make a burger. That sounds awesome. Okay, let's see if we can... If we can get this stack to be better. Oh, it's working. Kinda. 
I'm down to four units and I have to be beat 80 more. Here comes the final wave, my dude. All right, let's see how overpowered these spells actually are. Oh, these are elites. Get out of here, boy. No, no, he's gonna be left behind. Fight him back. Just make it really hard for them to cross. Flame NATO. More of these. A little bit of this. Oh no, more rocks. So if anyone was here at the beginning of the stream, I said that I felt like this was going to be a mechanic that is uh, super snowball-y. And this is exactly why, right? Like, the hero power kills enemies, the dead enemies feed into more hero powers, which just repeat the process over and over and over. And now we have like infinite stuff. This feel... It, what is what feels like is supposed to be a side note to the game is so incredibly oppressive as a result. Right? And we won. It's 1 a.m., but you don't want to stop watching. We only have one mission left, and then that's going to be the end of the day, so... It's a pretty easy answer there. I should not have won that. Like, straight up, I feel that I I made a sheep with the sheep's head being archers that then charged in forward and all died. And then I proceeded to lose, lose the entire sheep's body, had to fight over 80 people with four guys, and it was easy. That fundamentally feels wrong. It's so, so strong. But it's also balanced around that. All right. Crossing the Archeron. Let's, uh, let's cross. Imperium rules Orcus now, but the horizon beckons with promise of further conquests. Cast your die and drive your troops across the bridge. Erebus awaits. This is the last mission. Let's, uh, go orange. Orange is my mom's least favorite color. She just, she absolutely hates it. We can have evil people because they're wearing they're wearing dark clothes, which is the evil color, just like my chair and most of my shirt. Beyond that tiny edge, across the river Archeron. Asheron? I don't know. Now that you've reclaimed your land, it's time to go forth and invade to the home of... <laughs> I'm trying to read. Alajacta asked, as you a mighty imperator said once. Sure, I said it. What we got? We got this guy. This guy. Uh. Okay, someone said build a burger. We don't have enough guys to build a burger. Hmm. What do we do? What do we do then? It might be... It might be hammer time, but this time like a really, really thick hammer. Wolf guy, thank you for the sub. Um, let's see. Real, like this is gonna be the biggest old sledge head you've ever, I messed up. Let's try that again. The biggest old sledge head you've ever seen. Perfect. And then the archers are going to be the half. The haft. I'm a little bit spooked after that last mission, so I just need to make sure that my formation is both a hammer and very strong. Okay, you can reinforce that area. You can reinforce this area. And then 
We got two of these. You can be this part of the hammer and you can be this part of the hammer. Perfect. It's just these bonus objectives, I hate them. <laughs> it's just repeatedly use the worst mechanic. Go, go, go. Hopefully it just merges together by the time that we get there. That's what I'm looking for. What happens if we drop rocks on a tower? Are these guys going to join me? Are they going to be... No, they're undead. Oh. Yeah, okay, I made them... I made them that color. That's why they don't have a color. I guess it's a shade. Which makes sense, because we're in Erebus, so there's probably a lot of shades. Come on, guys. You look like you're kind of the boss. Are you the boss? What are you? Oh my gosh. That looks so fancy. And you just can't tell when you're not zoomed in. Hmm. Where do I want to drop my rocks? Let's just see what happens when we drop rocks up here. Perfect. The tower neutralized. Did it knock them off the tower? Okay, that's actually really neat. <laughs> I like that quite a bit. That's cool. You guys here? Wait, where's my stick? All my archers died. All my everything died. <laughs> That's not good. Yeah, it feels like the actual combat units that we have in this game are not good. But at least we have the hammerhead now. All right. I mean, we got to do what we got to do. If this is how the game is designed, then I will play by its rules. Even if I don't like it. Uh, whatever, just hit him with some bricks. I don't think that does damage. These guys will not move like three feet. Oh gosh, I have two units remaining. We're getting absolutely destroyed. Uh, you might need to go up here. You can take those guys down. Sending a bunch of troops. Like this guy would not go three inches, which is like not that far to go hit that guy. He was, like, on true hold position. Uh, we need to retreat. Oh, no. How many enemies do we have to beat? Pull back to strategic point. <laughs> Try to fight together. We have 13 enemies here. Drop that right there for the retreat. Oh, he's, like, pinned. That's not good. He's fine. Oh, he's dead. Same thing. Uh, game? I don't think that works. I feel like everything is broken here. <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on on this final mission. It's just everything is falling apart. Okay, he hit them really good. But there's just so many archers and I don't think he can deal with that. I gotta run. I think I can do this. There's only like 60 guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Sixty guys. Okay, now we jump on top of them. Suddenly I'm playing an action RPG. I have one character. I didn't buy the the spear went over there and the guy exploded. All right, well, <laughs> I don't really have any option besides trying. Are the camp icons on the left and the right reinforced? Oh, they might be. 
That was a good call. I was so focused on not losing that I... Where are you going, bud? Wow. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't question you. Tower Destroyer. Let's uh, hope that these are a lot of friends. It's weird that we haven't had cavalry. Here they are. But like, for the last half of the campaign, we just haven't had any. It's good to see them on the final mission. Yeah. Great to see you. But I'm not... Not convinced about their disappearance. Is it because they're too powerful? They might be too powerful. Yeah, you guys just head over here. Well, I'm in like really tried not lose mode at this point. I feel like silly formations worked really well and were the selling point of the game for 90% of the campaign. Then we got to the end and it's like, no, sir. Which honestly is very reasonable, right? Like if you're going to have it not work anywhere, then the very end of the campaign is where you want it to be. We've destroyed it. All right, we got more horses. My horse's forces. Uh, we got 10 of them. I think we go back to the tried and true arrow. The arrow seems like what we want to do to charge into this. There we go. They're not going to be able to beat this formation. We're going to pierce the skies with my horses. Because remember, the arrow is the spear of the skies. We're going to go... Nah. Let's blow up this horse. Get him. Let me send this guy in. It's working. Oh, he fell off. Yeah, get him. Big scary horse man is big and scary. Can we... Can we knock that guy off? No. Are we just gonna... We're not gonna finish the final boss fight against the demon because we accidentally captured the point again. What a incredible system that is. That's my favorite system. It's so good. We only did that like four times accidentally. Ah. <sighs> There's more. I don't think I want to play any more of this, honestly. <laughs> I think we did very well. I think that Avalon was a lot of fun. Uh, or not, uh, whatever we did. It was great. Uh, let me just, for people who are interested in this game, let me see. Hey, look, it's completely different faction. New abilities. Are these different units? Doesn't look like it, but it looks like they have different... Uh, unlocks and stuff so there definitely is a lot of stuff to do in this game uh yeah so i don't know i did a little bit of a showcase of it i wanted to see what this game was like i think i have a pretty good idea of it i think it's a fun little adventure probably not worth 19.99 which is what it's currently selling for on steam even though it's in early access i would say either wait for a sale or wait for more content Unless you really, really, really just like this thing and you want to give it a try. I think it's, uh, yeah, if this was about $4.99, I would say this is a really good game for the price and it would be just a fun little thing to do. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. That's going to be the end of the stream today. I have no idea what we're doing tomorrow, but we'll figure it out then. So thank you for watching. I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace.